We've had a pretty awesome preseason, eh? If I'm honest, it was obviously extended compared to what it would usually be, but um, that's only helped us out more. Um, obviously into Zebra, which was, I suppose you call it a bit of a blip, but before, right up until then, um, the standard of training and everything's been really awesome. So, as you say, it's a um, it's a pretty good environment to be welcoming those Irish lads back into. And, um, yeah, we really look forward to, to having them back in. Yeah, it's been critical for us uh, you know, over this preseason um, kind of block and the first five <coughs> games, I suppose. We've got a pretty good bunch of leaders and guys like Scott Fardy and we've obviously had Dev back, um, James Lowe, even guys like Max Deegan and, um, and the likes. They've always got a lot to say and that's, um, that's pretty important, especially with such a big divide. We've got a lot of young guys. Um, and not many that are kind of bridging the gap, you know, kind of mid-twenties, so... Um, yeah, it's certainly been important to have... Um, I suppose a guy like Scott Fardy has been around the block a long time. He's not nearly 40 now, so... <laughs> <laughs> um, he's, obviously seen, he's, obviously, <laughs> he's obviously seen a lot, and... Um, yeah, it's uh, awesome to have a head like that around for the younger guys, definitely. Coming into a pretty tricky period now with welcoming guys back in. Um, It'll be an interesting dynamic within the squad because the guys are obviously a bit down now, I suppose. But from what I've gathered and spoken to a lot of those lads, they're just really keen to get back in and, and start training and um, put their best foot forward. So uh, it's exciting times for the whole squad.